we'll be using the Apple-approved UV light. Although it resembles a standard flashlight, the UV light has warning labels attached. Liquid contact indicators, or LCIs, normally appear black and blend in with the surroundings. After an LCI has been in contact with liquid, it may swell temporarily, making it easier to identify. Because a swollen LCI can recede, there is a more reliable way to find triggered LCIs. This video shows how to use a UV light to reliably identify triggered LCIs. Let's practice a few safety tips first. Use the Apple approved UV light and keep the warning labels attached. Do not point the beam at faces or into eyes. Avoid repeated exposure to the light source. And if you choose to use a different UV light, wear safety glasses and gloves to avoid excessive exposure. Let's begin by pressing the power button on the UV light. Shine the light 12 to 14 inches away from the LCI and at an angle of 15 to 75 degrees. Check the color of the LCI. Under the UV beam, shiny blue is normal for an untriggered LCI. Shiny blue with a subtle pink halo means that the LCI has had contact with liquid. Once you identify one or more triggered LCIs, don't assume that the unit is denied coverage. Before determining an out of warranty repair, make sure that you can actually see liquid residue on system components. Be sure to follow the integrated troubleshooting flow to fully diagnose the issue. Well, that's it. Thanks for hanging out with me. Check out all the cool stuff and information located below. But with that, we'll see you soon.